We are going to study the unit number seven geometry, and our today's our topic is supplementary angles. By the end of the lesson, students, you will be able to define the supplementary angles, and you can solve how to find the supplementary angles. And today we will do the definition of the supplementary angles. Question number five, part D from the exercise seven B. Question number seven, part A and D from the exercise seven. Let's come to the definition of the supplementary angles. Two angles are called the supplementary angles if their sum is a one eighty degree. We know that the complementary angles, the sum of the two angles, will be the ninety degree if they are the complementary angles. In the same way, for the supplementary angles. Two angles will be the supplementary angles if their sum is a 180 degree. Students, you should remember that a straight line is always of an angle of the 180 degree. It is an important information that you should keep in your mind. Again, a straight line is always of an angle of the 180 degree. It means straight line always shows the 180 degree angle. Now come to the examples of the supplementary angles in the daily life. Here again, you can see the pizza. It is eight slices pizza plus these three parts of the pizza shows some angle. And again, this one slice also shows some angle. When we add these two angles, it represents a half of the pizza that here represented by the straight line. And we know that one straight line is always of the angle of the 180 degree. Here, when we add this angle and this angle, we can see that. It makes a one whole line that represents that it is of the angle of the 180 degree. So we can say that these three pieces of the pizza and this one piece of the pizza also represent the supplementary angles. This is a road, and this is a link road. How we can say that? This link road is made in supplementary angle with the this load. This link road has some angle with this main load, and this link road again has some angle with this part of the road. And when we can add these two angles, it shows a straight line that is of the one eighty degree. It means some of this angle and this angle is of the 180 degree. Now, come to some questions. Supplementary angles in this figure class. Here is the angle x of y and angle y of z. These both are the Supplementary angles. How we can say that these are the supplementary angles? X O Y is of the 50 degree, and Y O Z is of the 130 degree. And when we add the 50 plus 130, we get the result 180 degree. It means that these are the supplementary angles, and these supplementary angles may or may not be adjacent angles. Here is a question. Find supplementary angle of the given angle 127. We know that sum of the supplementary angles is 180 degree. Here is the given angle is 127 degree, and to find the supplementary angle, we will subtract the 127 from the 180 degree, and we get the 53 degree. 
Now, 127 degree and 53 degrees are the complementary angles because if we add them, we get 180 degree result. Now comes to the next question, find value of the y in each set of the supplementary angles. Here, this is an angle. This is an angle that is of 85 degree. And this is another angle that is unknown y. And we have to show that, that this y, value of this y. Now, we will add y plus 85 degree and uh, we should get the 180 degree because we have to find the supplementary angles. y plus 85 degree is equal to 180 degree. We will take the y here and take the 85 degree to the other side with the negative size. 180 degree minus 85 degree is equal to 95 degree. Now, 85 degree and 95 degree are the supplementary angles because their sum is a 180 degree. Next question is the find value of y in each set of supplementary angles. Here is the unknown angle y and here is the angle 150 degrees and the y plus 150 degrees should be equal to 180 degree. We take y here and move the 150 degree with the negative sign on the other side and we get the 130 degree. 150 degree and 30 degree are supplementary angles. Class, we have studied that if some of the two angles is 180 degree, then they are called the supplementary angles. And how can we find the supplementary angles? We can find one angle of the supplementary angle by subtracting it from the 180 degree. Session time. You can tell me that what is the supplementary angle of the 90 degree. Now, class, you have the one minute to think about that. What is the supplementary angle of the 90 degree? Yes, you are right. The answer is a 90 degree. First, you have to solve the question number five and seven on your notebook from the exercise 7B. Thank you.